YouTube, welcome to Pipes and Guitars, where I like to talk about my two loves, pipes and guitars. So today, we're doing the last installment of the Cornell and Dill Old One series based on the works of H.P. Lovecraft. Today, we're doing a musical tobacco review of Mad Fiddler Flake. So Mad Fiddler Flake, smoked it for a week, wrote a piece on it. In it, we have a couple of things. We have Black Cavendish, uh, the Cigar Leaf Casturi. <laughs> say that right. Perique and Virginia. So this is a Virginia-based blend. I have to say, I have enjoyed this this week. Now, that first smoke was in a pipe that I had not broken in all the way. And um, after smoking it in pipes that, that I trust, you know, some of my older pipes that are very well broken in, like this Peterson, that changed the flavor completely. Have you guys experienced that? Like you... Tried tobacco, you didn't like it, but then you smoked it in a different pipe, one that was perhaps a little bit more seasoned, a little bit higher quality, and a little bit more broken in, and you found that you really liked the tobacco in that pipe, but not your other pipes that are still good, but just not broken in quite as well. Have you guys had that? If so, let me know in the comments, because this was one of those for me. I think I found a Virginia that I actually like and might order again. This is like all of the flavors of Dreams of Quadath without the the nicotine buzz that accompanied it. It was very, very strong. This isn't quite as strong as that. It's still pretty strong, but not nearly as strong as Dreams of Kadath, in my opinion. This didn't knock me on my butt like that tobacco did. And a lot of you guys commented saying that it was because it was a plug. Well, that may be. You know, it may be because it was a plug there. The nicotine content is a little higher. So remember, Mad Fiddler Flake, uh, it's about the music of Eric Zahn, the short story by H.P. Lovecraft. And in that story... Eric, E-R-I-C-H, Zahn is a violinist who is mute. Uh, the guy living on the first floor of an apartment building hears him playing and comes up to see him one day, really interested. He plays these otherworldly melodies, and they, be they become somewhat friends, you know? So he comes up to visit him a little bit more, and one night he comes up, and he's madly playing. He madly plays every night, but he wants to do it in private, and he hears him playing a little bit more crazy than usual, and he goes up there to find out that the whole time he's been playing to keep the monsters or even a dimension at bay. Because when he looks out the window, he sees nothing but the void. There's no town, nothing. So he's madly fiddling to keep those monsters or dimensions at bay. Really cool story. So of course I wrote a piece on that and I really, really like it. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you can hear the mad fiddler in there somewhere. All right, so this is my musical piece written while smoking Mad Fiddler Flake. I hope you enjoy it. So that was the piece. I hope you enjoyed it. On a side note, I wanted to mention, I'm looking into maybe writing a Lovecraft album. Would you guys be interested in that? Uh, you know, I have a really good start using some of these pieces that I've already written and maybe fleshing that out. Uh, is that something you guys would be interested in? I was really surprised to find out Lovecraft had so many devout followers, and I, I found that out on this channel. So I want to thank you guys for 
helping me with the inspiration on that one. So look forward to that. Is that something you'd like? Let me know in the comments. All right, so Mad Fiddler Flake by Cornell and Deal, part of the Old One series. Have you had it? Did you like it? Let me know in the comments. And remember, love life, smoke a pipe, and keep on picking. I'll see you next time. All right, you made it all the way to the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember, if you like the content, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. We're growing a little bit every day. I'm going to put a couple of videos up there for you to check out. Check them out. Maybe you'll like them. Or you can stay here and smoke with me. Yes. <laughs>